The next question, Marshy, touches on the same subject. Marshy frequently, frequently makes the point during these news conferences that the unified field is a field of togetherness, of peace and dynamism. Quote, peace resides in dynamism, and dynamism resides in peace, Maharshi says. Question, I'm trying to grasp the practical significance of this statement, both for myself and for the world. Why is it important to know that peace and dynamism reside within each other, and why is it important to experience that truth? We know from our daily experience our daily life has a state of consciousness in perfect peace, deep sleep state of consciousness. Another level of consciousness where one knows what one is doing. So there is silence and there is dynamism. One gets tired of dynamism, one goes to sleep, to silence. One gets tired of sleep and one wakes up, comes to dynamism, one after the other. In one state of peace, one doesn't know what even one is sleeping. And in, in dynamism, one gets tired, one doesn't know how, uh, what silence is. So if there could be a combination of silence and dynamism, then silence will continue, dynamism will continue, neither silence will get tired nor dynamism will get tired, the life will be a continuum, eternity will become life. The two opposite values we want to live together so that we know a third level, which is a combined level of the two, because two we are experiencing. Silence we are experiencing, so much we are experiencing that we don't know what is silence. No experience. But if there could be a way where we could be silent and dynamic, then dynamism will not wear us out, will not get us tired. And deep sleep will be fulfilled with dynamism. So there is no question of waking from the deep sleep, and there is no question from waking from or getting tired from dynamism. When we have both, unified field means unified field unified. And what unified? Certainly, opposite values are unified. Similar values are similar. There is no unification in similar values. Only opposite values. When we say unified value, that means opposite values coming together. Now, what are the extreme two opposite values? Silence, dynamism, they are opposite values. They come together, and when they come together, then dynamism is perpetual, peace is perpetual, peace doesn't de devour dynamism, dynamism doesn't devour peace. Both remain. So life is lived on a cosmic level, and on the individual level at the same time. This is the supreme level of evolution of life, that the individuality enjoys practicality of cosmic reality. This is why we want two together, sleep and waking together.